I'm gonna show you guys how to get a shiny Pokemon for free in Pokemon Arceus. Now, this may be your only freebie that you get. Normally, getting a shiny in this game is actually absurdly difficult. Uh, the best chance you can get is one in 50, but normally just out in the field, if you do everything right, it's supposedly, I can't confirm this myself, I've only been told by word of mouth, but supposedly, it's over one in 1,000 chance to get a shiny. But this shiny, you can get for free by just doing a side quest. So there's a side quest with a peculiar Ponyta, and you will unlock this quest after, not even after chapter seven. So if we go to the mission logs, um, we have number seven. Once you complete it, you don't actually have to go turn in the last part. You'll be on your way to turn it back in, and it'll have you come into here to talk to whoever, commander, the guy at the top, I guess. And at that point, you'll notice this quest marker over here is lit up again if you've been doing the job board things over here. So you'll go over here and check it out. And even though you're not done with Chapter 7, it actually has some new ones. And one of those is called a Peculiar Ponyta. Okay, we click that. It says, Yodo, a fellow from the village, claims to have seen a rather strange Ponyta. You must investigate the matter for the good of science. So we grab that. Okay, and then um, we're going to back off of this. We're going to open up the menu again. We're going to go to our missions, and we're going to go over to requests, and we're going to make sure that we have that tracked. So the current objective is to speak with Yota to learn more about his request. And so Yota is over there in the village, and I'm going to skip ahead to us being over there. So if you go over here, you might be familiar with the village from here. It'll make it easier so you know where it is if the map doesn't help you. It's over this part of the village. On this bridge, here is Yota. And he says, you are here about my Ponyta request, right? Glad to have some help at last. Here's the problem. A Ponyta like no one's ever seen before has appeared in the Horseshoe Plains. It looks so different than the other Ponyta. It's a little scary, to be honest. But when I told the professor, he got all excited about researching it. So we agreed to have the Ponyta surveyed and see what's what. If you'd head to the Horseshoe Plains and catch that strange Ponyta for us, it'd really help us out. Okay, and then it says, catch the strange Ponyta on the Horseshoe Plains in the Obsidian Field Lands. Now you can just fast travel over to the front gate to save some time. And then once you're loaded in, you can go ahead and pick the Horseshoe Plains. So we go to here, and we actually, I don't have the Horseshoe Plains camp yet, but you can just pick the Heights camp. So once you actually load in to this zone, uh, the other one actually would have been faster. I misunderstood where the Horseshoe Plains was. It's actually over here, which is near the Fields Camp camp. And it is over where you may have seen the gigantic Rapidash. So I'm actually going to go to the Field Camp's camp. Once you load into the Field Camp's camp, you will head over to, you'll see the quest marker. It is right over there. And I'm just going to go skip ahead to where I'm already there. So when you get to the quest marker, you'll actually see nothing there, sort of. There's stuff around here, but not your objective. And once you get in, it'll trigger a cutscene. Oh my gosh! And it is a blue Ponyta. That's right. A shiny Ponyta. Oh, it's an unusual Ponyta. No kidding. So we need to catch the strange Ponyta. So, um, you can do this any way you want. At this point, you know, play it however you want. I'm just gonna run at it and chuck, po po uh, chuck Pokeballs at it like a madman. I'm just gonna run it down and keep doing that. Oh, and it disappeared. So if it re if it uh, runs away like that, you can just run around for a second. It'll spawn in. It'll make noise. It'll make an obnoxious animation and stuff, so you'll notice. Just stay in the area and run around for a sec, and then try again. And you'll just keep doing this until you catch the strange Ponyta. And there we go. You caught the unusual Ponyta. Time to report back to Yota in the village. So when you report your findings at the end, it'll actually show up as a, as a shiny in there, too. This will go for any shiny that you find. It actually has a shiny icon, so in the future, if you ever find any shiny outside of this free one, uh, you will know you found a shiny. It actually has an icon for it. So now if you head over to the pasture, you will have a shiny Ponyta in there. You can go ahead and move it into your party, even though the quest is not done yet. It still wants me to return and turn in the quest, but uh, yeah, you can just go ahead and grab it right now. But if you are at the pastures, you will notice Yoda has moved now. He is right here. So we're gonna chat with him and he says, I see you caught that strange Ponyta. You survey corpse folks sure don't mess around. You know, a friend of mine from Galar was surprised when he saw the Ponyta herds out in the field lands. He couldn't wrap his head around their fiery manes. At the time, I thought it was an odd thing to be amazed by, but now that I know some Ponyta have blue flames, it's not such a stretch to think there might be all sorts of them out there. And I'm not just talking about Ponyta, mind. 
Who knows how many different colored Pokemon there are in the world? I hope the Survey Corps keeps trying its level best to research them all. And then you complete the mission, get some raspberries, and now you have the shiny Ponyta. So there you have it. That is the easy free shiny Pokemon in Pokemon Arceus. If you want to get other shiny Pokemon, I'm going to be making a guide for that later. So be sure to subscribe for that. Also, if you want to keep up with me outside of this video, I also have my socials in the description of this video. Uh, just below the first paragraph, you know, Discord, Twitch, Patreon, Twitter type of stuff. But yeah, that is how to get your first free shiny uh, without actually doing any of the legwork in Pokemon Arceus.